I'm trying to find a way to glitch it through. I'm finding a way that it's glitching through the floor a little bit there. I'm hoping that's going to work. Does that work? Can we look? Does that work? Oh my god, that works. Oh my god, that works. <laughs> oh, that works. <laughs>
Normally when you right click on it, it crafts, but sometimes it doesn't. And you have to do that, which is really frustrating. I think it's just a bug. So yeah, that's a lot lower, as you can see. It's a hell of a lot lower, so it's going to just sit nicely. So we only need... I'm thinking about what sort of doors put over it as well. I feel like we only need it to be that wide. Actually. And just run some down there like that. I'm not sure how many I'm going to get out of this before I run out of materials, but I just want to see if we can get some decent amount of storage. Because then, if we want to go out and like pillage some some biomes, that's going to allow us to do it. That's that's cool. That's very cool. I don't think we need to go to the next level and get even more done. These always annoy me because you can't quite see where the grain goes. Is that right? It is right. Yeah, you can't quite see where the grain goes on that. Um, and that seems to work nicely there. So that fits there. So we know that's okay. So the next sort of path that we need to do is we need to run this down here as well and block this off like so and then we can build this up to level two like so we need to fill in that gap because i will forget and it'll annoy me did i get it i nailed it i got it and then this one here as well we can then do it i'm keeping all the wood grain going the same level as well the same way because i, f I feel that's that's quite important aesthetically when you're building stuff and then we can do the same thing here so it's, it's basically too wide we too wide there. We ran out of blocks again. Too wide there. We'll do that again. Catch it up. And then we'll run some more storage areas down here. And then we're just going to kind of fit some doors over the top of here. I think. The really thin doors. How thick are the doors? It's like some really thin doors. This one? Oh, that's three. That's three wide. Okay, okay, okay. If it's three wide. What we're going to do. This is how we break things super fast and get all your stuff back. Just going to go punch it with our hands. Like Conan on the Barbarian. So it now needs to be three wide. So it's a good thing we check that because then we don't have to like break it and lose everything. We're just going to we're just gonna pick up the stuff and, and redo it. So that's fine. So we do actually need to make it three wide. So remember kids, when you're putting doors on your ships, it needs to be three wide. Don't make it too wide, otherwise it won't fit. Um, so let's do that like that. And then what I want to see, if you go back to the doors again. I don't know if that's going to be the most aesthetic door. That one looks a bit better. Are you still three wide? It is still three wide. So what I want to see now is if we flip this that way. How many can we fit? One, two, three. And then which way do they open? I want them to open the other way. <laughs> I want them to open the other way. I knew that would be an issue. I want them to open the other way. Um, that's fine. Let's redo this. Let's do that. Do we do this? I'm going to crack on a little bit with this. And what I'm going to do is I'm kind of going to... I tend to do this when I'm doing big builds. I'm going to stick some music on. And I'm going to do this off camera. And I'm going to look at some pictures of old school pirate ships. And I'm going to try my hardest to kind of sculpt the back end to represent a pirate ship. I want the slope of it all. The thing that's going to get us at the minute is that the wood is is different colored to the base so it's going to stand out a little bit we need once we get our spray guns and stuff it'll look different but for now you're going to see the difference in it you're going to see the difference in the wood contrast and the color uh, not much we can really do about that until we get the spray gun until we get the dyes and stuff but let's get cracking cue the music for me not for you because copyright and things this now needs to go that way yeah i want it to open that way so yeah i'm going to crack on and hopefully, very, very shortly, for you at least, not for me, mine's going to take ages, but for you guys, in just a few moments, <laughs> the ship will be nearly be done. I'll see you in like an hour or something stupid, maybe two. Depends how dark it gets and how fast. Perfect. Little bit of an update on the ship. It's getting there. I like it. Um, I've started putting in some like bevels, some extra little bits. This is going to end up tilting back. When I finish with this, is going to come back a little bit more. Um, I need to put some like stuff down, make it a bit more like a bit more supported. But I like how it's looking. I like how it's looking. The back bit is probably going to have something underneath it to pull it down a little bit. There's a hole there. Who hello hole? The hole there. There's some random wood poking out of there. But originally it was quite square. And I've kind of just put some stuff in it. It's been 
I'm going to be honest, it's been about two hours doing this. I've had to remove quite a lot of wood and redo it. So it is, get, it is getting there. It is getting there. Um, what I'm trying to do now is just kind of finalize the upstairs shape. We've got the helm earth in here where I want it. But I'm feeling like the back area might have just like a little lip over the top of it. Not necessarily even to climb up. I might not even have it as a climbing area. It might not even be something that we can we can access and we can use. It might just be there for aesthetics. I think. I think. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. But for nowsies, I'm just going to continue with this. I just want to give you guys an update. It does take a long time doing stuff like this. It takes a hell of a long time doing stuff like this. Um, the wood block situation um, is, is, is dire. We're using a lot of wooden blocks. A hell of a lot of wooden blocks. Um, yeah. <laughs> Absolute tons of wooden blocks. Um, the trees have grown back. The, the the glitch trees that I wanted, they've all grown back. So if need be, we can reuse them, which is going to be which is going to be very, very handy. I'm trying to find a way now to make this slope outwards when it can't slope outwards because this is already here. This back wall. So I'm going to try and figure that out a little bit. I might... Ugh. It's hard. It's hard to think because on the, on the edges, you can't. I could do that and just bulk them out like that and do it out one more. That would work. That would definitely work. Um, and even putting like that there would work. Or if I put it on the inside of it, uh, potentially doing one of um, these. Spin this round like so. One of those that would work that could possibly work so I'm, I'm kind of playing with the styles of what i'm after because I, I know roughly what i want i just want to make sure it looks it looks decent i mean let's just have a quick check at that see that's coming out which is nice i can't that's what i want it to do i want it to step up maybe two or three times at the back uh, maybe here and then maybe out on that little bit there and then maybe out even one more up there possibly and then i kind of want the back area the top of the back area to be just underneath where the sails are going to be it's going to be quite high and then the front area i'm going to do the same with the front area i'm actually going to pull up a little bit i might end up getting rid of this and building my own not sure i kind of if i'm going to do it it's going to take me a long time to record for you guys it's still only going to be 15 20 minutes to watch but i kind of feel like if i'm going to do it let's do it right yeah i like i like how it's looking quite Organic now. I like it. Okay. More work to be done. Okay, guys. I'm just about to put this sail down. I'm trying to find a way to glitch it through. I'm finding a way that it's glitching through the floor a little bit there. I'm hoping that's going to work. Does that work? Can we look? Does that work? Oh, my God. That works. Oh, my God. That works. <laughs> that works. That works. I feel like we do need another mast in the middle. Another large mass in the middle. Probably for the future. Oh my god, that works. Look at that. We have a pirate ship. It's not perfect. It's not perfect. But it has been about four hours making this. It's been a big old build. It's been a, a huge old build. Um, I do kind of wish that joined there. It's a little bit annoying. Can I make that work there? Oh, I can. Do you know what? I can. I do that there. Does that look terrible? Yeah, you can kind of see the top of it. I don't mind it that much, actually. That doesn't look as bad as I thought it would do. Um, and then what we can do with this is maybe run it one more along. And then hit one of these up. So this isn't, this isn't the final iteration of this ship. Whoops. By any means. It's not the final iteration. There's lots to do. So there's still like glass to put in it. Oh yeah. Just pick up everything other than what I wanted. There's still like glass to put in it. There's still um, little tweaks here and there that I can do on it to, to improve it. To make it even better. There's still little tweaks that I can do. I'm going to end up moving um, the ladders for example because they're not quite right. Even though they, they are both level and bang on. One of the ladders are a bit further on than the other side. Stuff that I need to do. This down here needs a little bit more work as well. Mainly like this part. I'm not entirely sure what to do with that. That might be a case of like maybe just doing some some sideways things. Like just to give it a little bit more... Um, 
I was going to say attitude. Attitude is the wrong, the wrong word, but um, you get what I'm saying. Give it just a little bit more. Uh, a little bit more thing. I like that. But now I feel like I might want the whole thing to be done like that. I don't know. This is cool. I like this. I like this. I may bring it out one more block. Or maybe even two blocks. I might remove that top corner and bring out another block or two and have it like that. Possibly. Not entirely sure. It's not going to be something that I think I'm going to climb on. I might have a ladder hanging down from it so I can spy and stuff from it. It's getting super dark. I'm going to wait till the daytime and then kind of just show you this. I'm going to head back to the base and then show you this back in the daytime before we end. Wow. It's taking me many hours. We've got a pirate ship. Just waking up, eating some ham haunch. Looking out my window. At my ship. That is cool. That is very, very cool. Let's see if I can get a nice look from, from the roof. I might make a diving board. Um, festive star, no thanks. I might make a diving board from up here. Or at least find a way I can jump. Shall I just try it? I feel like I might die. You only live once. Oh, YOLO! Oh, wow. That's a bit dangerous. I did it. Um, but yeah. The ship is looking super, super sick. I'm very, very, very happy with it. As I say... I don't think it's a final iteration. There may be some little bits and pieces where I like join. I can't even do it. I'm going to need to propel propeller pack is what I'm going to need. Um, I feel like I might join some of this up again. Like some little bits going up. and that, I'm not sure. I, that's what I feel like I might do just to give it a little bit more features. This needs a little bit of work down here still. This is still a little bit rough for my liking. A little bit rough. Needs a little bit of polishing. Can we... I'd love to like... There we go. I'd, <laughs> I'd love Ireland's developers, Bohemian Games, to make it just a little bit easier for, like, turning the blocks. They've made it brilliant now. You can find the blocks. I haven't made a, a, a single wrong block so far, which has been really good. Saved a lot of resources, a ton of resources. A ton of all resources has been saved, which is very, very cool. And I'm not sure, because I wanted to kind of make a to-do list. And have it around the base so we know what we're doing. But I'm not sure if it shows text. And if it doesn't, it's going to be a little bit pointless, isn't it? Because I kind of I kind of want a, a reminder for when we're doing stuff, when we're recording stuff. Like a reminder for what you guys want to see and what like things you want me to build. Um, and, and things you want me to find and things you want me to do. And I can't really do that unless there's a, a physical list because I'll just forget. That looks a lot tidier. That's a lot better. I love that the mass is on the front of it. I feel like we should try and set sail. I feel like we should try and set sail. I think before we do, I am just going to dig out this bit over here. We've got, what is it? One, two, three, four, five, six. Six blocks? Six blocks. I'm going to dig out a six block areas. About there. Maybe there. Are these all single blocks? Why did I put single blocks here? Yeah, let's maybe do it before the single blocks. Um, yeah, I'm going to quickly dig out a six block area. Maybe even just using this. Oh, that's faster. Because I want I want to have an area where we can stick down another mast. Not today. I have no time today to do it. There we go. Um, not definitely not today. But um, in the in the very very near future, I feel like that's something we want to be doing. I, I am worried that I'm hitting the boat there. I don't really fancy sinking the boat by accident. So I, I'm just gonna quickly dig this up, and then we know in the future we've got the space then for the extra mast. I'm gonna lose some blocks doing this, but I think it's a lot faster than the destruction hammer. Which is really terrible. All righty then. Done. I'm not touching it anymore. I am not touching it anymore. We are ready to sail. Assemble the ship. What's it doing? Did it assemble? Oh yeah, all the lines have gone. All the lines have gone, guys. That dropped the anchor, didn't it? Does that just make a splash down the side? I can't tell. I think that's it. I think that's it. And crew. Disassemble. Oh, cool. So you can use a disassemble mode to take things apart from it and then assemble it. And I think the assemble thing stops it from... Yeah, I think it... There's all... Oh, they've all gone down. Even the front one went down. <gasps> this is cool. 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 Anchor up, please. Captain Smee. Let's go. 
<laughs> we are off, boys! Sailing the seven seas! This is amazing. This is a good looking ship. This is a good looking pirate ship. Look at that. Can you imagine? The amazing pirate ship. Bye, house. Look how fast we're going. This is insane. We definitely need an extra sail on it. I think we need an extra sail just to finish it off. Because I think it's like it's like a galleon size. I feel like we just need that extra sail. What we do also need as well. Probably on the back of the ship is a wind indicator. So we can tell where we're going. Let's just drop. Drop the sails fully. Spin it around. Spin it around, Mr. Smee. Coming back into the base area. Yeah, we just need, we need some colour on this as well. Um, you guys can let me know in the comments below what colour you want to see this. What colour do you want? Whichever colour gets like the most hearts and stuff, we'll go for. Um, most thumbs up and stuff, we'll just choose that. We'll go for that. Uh, we need to remove... Yeah, why are those in different places, look? You can even see like there's a little porthole thing in the doodler. And the ladder's next to it and that one's over it. Strange design, but anyways. Let's take this back to base. You guys let me know in the comments what you would like to see the colour of the ship. I'm feeling like a black ship. Like a blacky grey pirate ship because it's the pirate ship. So I feel like that's what we should go for. Um, I'm probably not going to do any exploration on the next episode. I don't know because I'm kind of trying to get some episodes done in advance. So I might not do um, an exploration episode on the next one. I might build the dock. Possibly. Or I might look at getting the propeller pack. I don't know. I don't know. Let's see. But thank you so much, guys, as always, for liking, commenting, and subscribing. We're coming back into the dock now. Hard on the brakes. Spin it round, Captain Shmee. Oh, look at that. We don't want to go too far. Yes. Love the family, guys.